Hey guys, Bleach here, and today I am going to be doing a new Let's Play of a PlayStation 2 game that I really enjoyed when I when it was back on the PS2. It was one of the um, Need for Speed games. Need for Speed Underground for the PS2 being played on the PS3. And I didn't see that there was an um, actual Let's Play of this game, so I have decided to actually do EA it. Games. Challenge everything. And we'll just see how it goes. My name is Mark DeVellis, and I race in the Toyota Atlantic series. I work with the team at EA. Tuning the cars for Need for Speed Underground. I may push the limits of my car on yeah, the track. Yeah, give they the whole, um, I drive safely you know, and responsibly. This Thank isn't for the track, what you're supposed to be doing on speed, actual streets. Just play underground. So. Right. Need for Speed on the ground. I love this game. Yes, I would like to create a driver profile, please. Because I haven't started one yet. Yeah, fuck it, whatever. Alright. 
um, like any racing game, it has, you know, story mode, the quick race, you know, play with your friends, how you're doing, you can customize your ride, the options, you know, upload different driver profiles, and actually play online, pretty cool, but I'm going to this underground, welcome to underground mode, your racing career starts here, take on the toughest drivers on the street and prove you want to Winners are cool. Unlocks upgrades. Losers go home. Let's go. The game was beast when it first came out. It's one of my favorite Need for Speeds. But it doesn't top um, Most Wanted to me. Most Wanted was the best Need for Speed to me because it was just it was awesome I mean 15 bosses a lot of racing to do yeah it was just really good stuff I love that game just like I love this one okay so you guys know Need for Speed and the people at Need for Speed they give you a fast car to give you the taste of the speed but then they knock you down a peg and you know give you back Bummy cars you actually need to start with. Like any other racer has its shortcuts and you know its stuff. It has nitrous and all that good stuff. But how do I use my nitrous? I don't remember. Oh yeah, you earn style points. I don't remember what the style points exactly do. I know you earn them. And that was a shortcut. And that was a I got enough of a good lead to not have to take shortcuts. Okay, that's how you hit the nitro. Um, I don't know if the nitro recharges on here, like it's like in the later uh, versions of the game. Wow, I am not doing too good. Yeah, the um, nitrous. Doesn't seem to recharge. So. That's good to know. Now that I know. Woo, that was close. I got smoked. Yeah, I don't remember what the style points do. I think they're just there. Um, of course, like the other race, it has like different camera views. Oh, it just has it has that up close car kind of view inside the car. Yeah, it's just like any other you know, good racing game. Now, I chose Underground um, over Midnight Club. Then when Midnight Club 3 came out, or was it 2? I think it was 3. The Midnight Club 3 came out. Around Center Two Underground Two came out, and Underground Two was just, I think, was a disappointment. I did not like it whatsoever. <laughs> Is that your fantasy? Look, that's Ed. Take a good look, man. He's a winner. And that's a jerk. We need to man. take down. It ain't just about the car. And it's pretty it's ass right. So, which one of these is your car? Okay, so I have enough cheddar to actually buy me a car. So we have a choice between a Volkswagen Golf GTI. Honda Civic, a pug, a pug, whatever, a Miata, and a Dodge Neon. Now I think I am going to go with. I'm going to go with the Dodge Neon. Ouch! That is seriously weak, dude. I know, man, because y'all gave me this weak ass car. Hey, loser. <laughs> Alright, check it. Maybe I can help. Just call me a loser. Just you and me, one on one. It's money in the bank. Let's go. You want to be the best? You gotta take these boys down. Oh, I thought my mic was off. I was about to say. You're gone. Got it? Good. Now move it. 
Come here to find the latest race. Okay. The race map will show you where all the action is. So, you get to choose the um types of races that you can do. There's circuit, sprint, drift. I've got the head drift on here. Crap. Um, drag and lap knockout. Okay, but let's go back and go to the um customized ride thing. Hey, what you think? You digging it? Then you gotta win. No racing grab, no cool parties. Wanna look cool and go fast? Here you buy upgrades and turn your car into the baddest ride in the street. Sick. So you get if you see at the bottom like the lower right hand corner like if your when your car starts looking good on us then you get reputation 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 points can you say the word you get those points and you um I don't know just whatever um another thing is that you don't you only own one car throughout the whole game what happened is you just traded in for a different car so what I'm gonna do here is that I don't like the color green, so I want to change that. I know, sorry, I didn't mean to press that button. Welcome to the paint. And you only get the basic choice of colors right now because you know you just practically start. Um, I think I like the color blue, so I'm gonna go blue. You can paint the rims in the spoiler, which I don't have. Um, let's check out the body. It costs money to, you know, put a body on your car, but I'm not worried about that right now. Uh, um, let's check out the performance. Can I get any performance things? Nope, I'm broke. Okay. Just change the color of my car. So the first race, I think I'm going to try to knock out is the, um, I'm going to go for the drift first. Yeah, he taught this mess. Anyway, um, the thing about this game is that they gave you, like, difficulties that you can choose for each race for each going on for each race now what I will recommend that you do is that you take on hard in the beginning and then you probably will just do medium and depending on your strength and weaknesses easy but for now I'm gonna play on hard and we're just gonna see how this goes now I haven't drifted in a long time so this is gonna be kind of interesting to see how I do I might suck for you guys, you never know. Okay. Um Yeah, you just you just hit the emergency brake and you just let your car drift. Ah! Almost hit the wall. Yeah, you hit the wall, you lose all your cheddar, aka points, you don't wanna do that. You wanna keep the chain going as much as you can. I'm in the lead right now, but not much. And you just go side to side. Keep it as chained as much as possible. Because you just earn 